So here he is, one of the best athletes in this loaded UFC lightweight division, repping the combat club in South Florida, training under Henry Hooft. Here is Michael the Menace Johnson, talented southpaw, outstanding boxer, wrestler, great takedown defense. He's worked a lot of late on body maintenance, working on his conditioning, and trying to maintain the speed and the wrestling that got him to be one of the best 155 pounders in the world. This guy has ruthless one-punch knockout power. You can't teach it, but when a fighter has it, it's a huge advantage. Pro dating to 2008, here is Khabib Nurmagomedov, one of the best wrestlers and grapplers to ever step foot inside this octagon. And the striking has really started to round into form. You know him as a Sambo master. This is a guy who immediately upon stepping foot inside the octagon was a force to be reckoned with at 155 pounds. On his best night, he's the best 155 pounder in the world. We'll see if he is at his best here tonight under the lights. This guy has devastating takedowns. The ability to get his opponent to the mat time and time again has proven to be one of the most effective tools in his arsenal. And now our kill the tape for this lightweight scrap. Johnson is two years his senior. He will have a three-inch reach advantage. We send it inside the octagon. The veteran voice is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A mixed martial artist holding a professional record on. 20 wins, 13 losses. He stands five feet, 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Only a professional record of 27 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, Habib the Eagle, Imagomedov! And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Labou. So Eve Levine draws the. Are you ready? Are you ready? All right, we are underway here at the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, Nevada. Well, they say everybody loses in mixed martial arts. I guess everybody except the Eagle, Khabib Nurmagomedov. Impossibly difficult to get this guy off of you once he takes you down. How do you prevent that from happening? Is the question for the opponent tonight. Nice. Joe, your thoughts on what we'll see in this matchup tonight? Habib Nurmagomedov is one of the best wrestlers in MMA today, and his takedowns are absolutely spectacular. Look for them to be a big factor in this fight tonight. Oh, oh, slams it down. down with conviction, man! Big right hand by Nurmagomedov. Oh, postures up and lands a huge head strike there. Nicely done by Nurmagomedov. Oh, he's hurt. That's that it. it. That's it. The fight is over. Big TKO victory early in the first round. Yeah, Joe, how's that for a flurry to end this fight here tonight? It was the one big strike that was the beginning of the end got the knockdown and then created the opening that allowed him to jump in and ultimately force the stoppage victory. So the referee made the right call stepping in and preventing him from absorbing any further damage. And here's the end of the fight. We can see it here from another look. These are clean shots that are getting in over and over again, ground and pound for the TKO finish. And here we see it from another camera angle. 
So a massive TKO win for him here tonight. He put it all together, near perfect execution, and he gets one of the bigger wins of his UFC career. Bruce Buffer now with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at one minute, six seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by TKO, Habib All right, so a big win tonight for Khabib Nurmagomedov. They say everybody eventually meets their match in mixed martial arts. It hasn't happened for Nurmagomedov yet. And you wonder what type of fighter, striker, is going to be able to find the recipe to be Khabib Nurmagomedov once again, proving that he is one of, if not the best lightweights in the world.